Alright, this is a video tutorial on how to animate images inside Sony Vegas um, Studio Platinum 9.0. What you want to do is you want to start off by opening your project or just the program. Right here, I've got a I got a project open already. I was just working on this. It was like a goodbye thing for uh, Call of Duty. All right, let's. We want to create a new project. Yeah, let's want to cancel the operation. We'll call this um, image animation. Let's finish. Alright, right here, then what you want to do is you want to start off by importing your clip. And the clip I'm going to use is, uh, where is it? I'll just use this by SNS i360. This is his 360 clip. And I'm gonna, we're going to start off by setting up the clip. And what we want is 1.33333 or whatever. HDV 180, 1080. Alright, and when you click OK, it'll stretch it all out. And there's also something else we can do to it. Um, project properties. I think, yeah. Frame rate, and we'll leave it at that. Pixel aspect ratio, apply, and that will be it. Alright, now you can see your clip will play like normal. Alright, now what we want to do is uh, we'll name the, rename this to image. Alright, then what we're going to do is project import media documents and my pictures now I've already got a picture right here and we're going to use this it's a transparent image all right it automatically if you double click it automatically imports it and right here we're going to go pan and crop and we're going to zoom out so that it makes the image smaller you'll zoom out to make the image smaller Alright, so we'll get it about there and then position it so it's in the corner. Alright, now as you'll see, if you just play the video, it'll just, it'll just be there. But what we want is for it to move. So for your keyframe, this is where, it, this is the position it'll be in, in your very first keyframe. Alright, and then what you want to do is by the end of the video, have it be all the way on this side. So then, what you'll do is you'll click and drag so that it's positioned. Oh, I won't show it to us right now. Ah, oh, I see. This is just the images. So if we click and drag, by the time it gets to here, it'll be as far over as we can get it. So now if you see Um, that might be all right. Well, now what we gotta do is, since I actually dragged it out, what we wanna do is drag it in, then completely drag it out. Go to pan crop, zoom out, choose its position. Uh, we gotta delete that keyframe. We wanna be on the very first keyframe. so it's right there the very last keyframe it will be positioned right there so as you see it'll be moving all the way across all right so if you play it it'll be moving very slowly across this and let's turn down the volume a bit the image will be moving across 
Alright, something else that I can show you guys how to do is how to make a moving image like uh, in my editing test with the crosshairs. So you import media, documents, my pictures, um, let me find it. Save this as a PNG 18, which is why it looks so funny, but that's okay. Alright, there we've got the image, and we want it to actually appear. Let's put that in there. Alright, right there. Let's delete that. small as you can get it. And we want it to start appearing. Let's see where it gets the 360. Right here. And we want that to be zoom in. We want it to appear right here. It's gotta come onto the screen, do a little swirl, and then so what we'll do is we'll split that right there and then we'll split the part where he actually makes the shot which would be right there alright and thi in this portion it will really split where it's kind of up here so right now no wrong part in the very beginning it's just going to be off the screen alright but now right here going to make its way center. So actually that wouldn't work. Forgot. Well I'll make a new keyframe one right here and we get to right here we create a new keyframe and that's when it's gonna so come on really fast alright and then right here, it's going to come down just a bit more. I'm going to make it look very fluent. So each keyframe, move it just a bit like you would in an animation. always refer back to this then it'll start making its way that's one more oh whoops delete right That's when we'll center it. Actually, we should have centered it there. So now, right here, if we select it, go build dynamic RAM preview, it'll be in the center when we want it to be. Alright, so now let's watch it.
right? And we can also stop it right there and fade out. So we'll even get a nicer like that. And then we'll just delete that part so that it doesn't continue. And just to add a nice touch to it, we'll go import media, documents, music, let's see. Some nice music right here. Alright. And if we fade that out, delete that. You now have your very first animation in Sony Vegas. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Look forward to more. Thank you.